Disclaimer, this video is strictly for educational purposes. The techniques demonstrated should only be used ethically and within the bounds of the law. Misuse of these methods can lead to serious consequences. Before diving in, make sure you've installed Kali Linux on your system. If you're unfamiliar with Kali Linux, it's a powerful platform specifically designed for penetration testing and ethical hacking. I have complete tutorial about how to install Kali Linux and set up your hacking lab as a beginner. You can watch it by clicking on the I button. Let's move to the installation process for PhoneInfoga. Open your terminal and start by cloning the PhoneInfoga repository from GitHub. Go to web browser and type PhoneInfoga GitHub and copy the code. Open your terminal and type git clone and the link we copied. Once the repository is cloned, navigate to the folder using the command cd PhoneInfoga. Next, ensure you have all the dependencies installed by running the setup script provided in the repository. This will prepare your system for using the tool. Once the setup is complete, you're ready to start gathering information about a phone number. To begin, launch the PhoneInfoga tool by typing python 3 phoneinfogap in your terminal. Let's use a test number for this demonstration to ensure compliance with ethical hacking practices. Input the command python 3 phoneinfogapy n then any number. The tool will start processing the input and return a detailed report. This report typically includes information like the country where the number is registered the carrier and its format validation. Depending on the number's public presence, it might also uncover linked social media accounts or additional metadata. These insights are drawn from public resources and databases, making it a valuable resource for OSINT investigations. As you can see, the results can vary significantly based on the number's public exposure. Dummy numbers or virtual numbers might yield limited data, while real numbers often provide richer details. Remember, we are using demo number here, and always use it ethically and responsibly. However, it's important to emphasize that any information retrieved should only be used for ethical purposes. Never use this tool to invade someone's privacy or conduct unauthorized investigations. This concludes the demonstration of Phone in Foga. We've walked through the installation, setup, and practical use of the tool on Kali Linux. Remember, ethical hacking is about protecting and strengthening security, not causing harm. If you enjoyed this video and found it educational, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to support the channel. Leave your thoughts in the comments below, and let us know what you'd like to see next.